seven, eight, nine. Gimme, baby. Today, we're gonna teach you a game that's perfect for playing with your golf buddy that you go out every single weekend with. It's a game that we invented. Well, it's a game that we kind of tweaked from a different game that already existed. It's called tape measure. It's called tape measure golf. Yeah, that's about right. <laughs> the first thing you need to know about tape measure golf is it's all based off handicap. If you don't know your handicap, just guess. I'm a 10, Tyler's a 16. I'm an 18. Okay. okay, so that's how many feet of gimme length that we get on each hole. If I'm 10 feet away from the hole, I get a 10 foot gimme. If Tyler's 18 feet away from the hole, he gets an 18 foot gimme. Anything within that range, pick the ball up and head over to the next hole. There are a few more rules. We'll explain those when we get up there. Shorty. Deep again, right? Second rule of tape measure golf, right? We already established that I'm an 18 handicap. So not only do I get an 18 foot gimme, I get 18 feet of relief to move my ball. My ball is right there, bright greeny. Pin is directly behind these trees. So what I'm gonna do with my 18 feet of relief is I'm gonna move it to the left so I can get to the pin. But however far I move it is deducted from my 18 feet. So I need to go about right here, five feet. Now I only have 13 feet for the rest of my nine holes. And it takes my gimme range from 18, now it's only 13. Or just put it in the hole! My handicap is 10, it went down the last couple days. I should have sandbagged it for this round, but um, I gotta get within 10 feet for a gimme, so. Get the tape out. That's gonna be close. Seven, eight, nine. Gimme baby, nine and a half. Big time loss for me. Not only did I lose the hole, Ryan didn't have to shave any of the feet off his gimme, so things are looking bad for me. That's munched. Probably the drive of the year by me. I got a five iron in my hands because it's the only thing I can hit straight. That's an eagle putt right there. That actually might even be in the hole, Tyler. Deep. Lay off the roids, my guy. Nine iron. There it is. Okay, well, we gotta pull the tape off for this one. You can see it right in there. Oh, God. I'm gonna move it five feet. All right, so I'm down to five feet total. 10 handicap, moved it out five. Ah! Oh! Fly bite! Why? First a bee, last video, now a fly. That fly bite hurt worse than the bee. God. I paid the flies to bite him to mess with his game. That's a par. I just got bit by a fly too. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. God! <laughs> I'm sinking this putt. I'm pissed off now. That's in. Mm. Is that within five? Well, I moved it out six, so I only have four feet left. That is outside the four foot range. Good putt. Doesn't even matter. Good putt. Doesn't even matter. What'd you get, Ryan? I got a par. All right, so we're five holes deep. What do you got for gimme feet left? I got four feet left. Yeah, I'm at 12 and a half. I burned a lot of feet on the very first hole, and then I burned six inches. Uh, story of my life. All right, baby, Ryan's up one. I'm coming back. I'm tired of losing to him. <laughs> me. <laughs> Golf is stupid. Hell yeah. Deep, maybe? Nope. <laughs> See, another thing I love about this game, in real life, the chances of me missing that putt are super high. So I can end this hole on a high rather than wanting to throw my putter in the river. I gotta put this one with, within four feet to tie this hole. Go. Not bad, I can, I can make this putt. You bastard. They said it couldn't be done and it was done. Bingo! All right, we're all knotted up. Going to the last hole here. Two to two match play. I have no gimme range left. It's not gonna do it. You're lucky at a tree or that was going over the road. Ooh, we're gonna be in some tree trouble. Oh no, go, 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 go. I don't know what to do anymore. I don't know what to do. We are really making this final hole just a barn burner. <laughs> From my ball, tree directly in the way. I almost have to take it unless I'm gonna try and lay up again, which I can't do. Yeah, I gotta do it. I have no other choice. We both gotta put it in the hole now. I lost it, Jake. Oh no. 
No. Let's go. Um, it's over. Ryan's going to win. Ooh, is that the winner right there? It's over. Oh, man. Okay, well, this is, uh, I mean, a two putt to win. For the dub? Is that a bogey? You talked to my backswing. <laughs> no, you talked to my backswing. But you asked if it okay, was for okay. the dub, so okay. I answered. Did I just f miss that putt? You talked to my backswing. Yeah, because you asked a question. The rules are rules. You, if you make this, we tie. <laughs> and that is a wrap, folks. I'll take that game of tape measure golf. Uh, a lot of strategy that goes into that. Take your handicap. That's how many feet you get of playable distances if you want to make a better lie or take a gimme on the putt. Grab a tape measure. 25 footer works the best. Get out with your buddies, get some handicaps and play and have some fun playing tape measure golf. Well, that's a breakfast ball.